Highland Tank provides the most innovative and reliable oil water separators in the industry. Our oil water separators, featuring the patented Corella Coalescer, are designed to remove oil, grease, light petroleum products, and oily coated solids from a variety of wastewater discharges. Many industrial facilities require high efficiency oil water separators. Since developing our oil water separators in 1986, Highland Tank has installed separators for industrial applications including electric utilities and power plants, petroleum production facilities, airports, municipalities, and transportation companies. Highland Tank's patented separators are unparalleled in performance, ease of maintenance, structural strength, and product compatibility. Our engineers design highly efficient primary separation methods that meet or surpass federal, state, and local oil and grease discharge limitation requirements. Hi, my name is Tom Schoendorf with Highland Tank. I work as the division manager for the wastewater treatment system products. This is a family of products that treats different types of uh, stormwater and wastewater from industrial activities. The division includes a, a family of products including interceptors, oil water separators, and high-end filtration systems. Behind me, we have an RHTC 300-gallon oil water separator for an above-ground installation. Typically, oil water separator applications are generated from federal, state, and local regulations. The federal regulations we have in place are the EPA. Uh, we have two regulations with the SPCC, or Spill Prevention Control and Countermeasure, or your NPDES program, which is your National Pollutant Discharge Elimination Systems. These regulations target industrial type customers or facilities that can generate an oily waste. So the oil water separator is designed to pick up that drainage of industrial waste, separate the oil from water, and discharge at an acceptable level on the outlet side. One important feature to note with the oil water separators is access. An oil water separator, you have to have access to inspect and maintain the oil water separator properly. Here we have an above ground oil water separator that has complete removable lids or sections that gives the customer complete access to the uh, inside of the oil water separator. This is removed with wing nuts. If we were dealing with an underground oil water separator, we would have large access manways with covers. Usually with oil water separators, we're going to gravity flow or pump flow on the inlet side. Um, typically, if we're going to pump flow, that would be a positive displacement pump that will not mechanically emulsify the oil and water. As the flow comes into the above ground oil water separator, it hits the diffusion baffle. The diffusion baffle serves as three functions. The first is it slows down the velocity of flow, creating a nice laminar flow in the tank. It also, as the flow hits the 45 degree plate, it diverts the flow to the front of the tank utilizing the full length of the vessel to allow oil to float in water as it travels through the tank. The other thing it does is it disperses the flow to the full width of the tank, utilizing the full surface area of the coalescers. So as the flow hits the diffusion baffle and works its way underneath the baffle, large solids would drop out in the waste stream in the sludge hopper. At the bottom of the sludge hopper, there is a fitting where you can remove the solids at the bottom of the hopper. The flow is then directed through the Corella plates. The Corella plate is a patented design by Highland Tank. It's a PVC material that is very robust in different types of uh, hydrocarbon applications, but it's flat on top, very smooth, and then corrugated on the bottom. It's angled upwards at about 25 degrees, so as the oily water comes through, solids would settle on the flat top, slide off and collect in your sludge hopper, and as oily water is moving through the underside of the plate, the corrugations will trap the oil particles, forcing it to stick together or coalesce. And the idea is the bigger the droplet of oil, the more buoyant it's going to be in water. So it's directing the oil upwards as the solids are sinking at the bottom of the hopper. After the flow moves through the inclined Corella plates and separates the larger droplets of oil, the flow then goes through the uh, secondary coalescer, which is the Petro screens. Now the Petro screens are steel, coated steel cartridges, and we install a Petro screen, which is an oleophilic mesh material. It's cut and sized and placed inside of this uh, box, which is removable through the top and can be cleaned. And basically the Petro screen will 
target very small oil droplets down to 20 microns, again, forcing them to coalesce and then rise to the top of the tank. Now, we also install a downcomer pipe here, and the downcomer pipe is set at about 20% off the bottom of the tank, and essentially that just takes clean water from the bottom of the vessel as oil is trapped on the top of the tank. So as we move through, the oil is trapping or separating on top of the water. The clean water is flowing to a clear well here, and then either gravity flowing out or we're going to pump out on the outlet side. Now, for clean out on these oil water separators, we have a 4-inch oil pump out pipe. Now, this oil pump out pipe is set at an elevation inside the tank, and it's set with your float system, so when you get a high oil alarm, the vac truck company can come, stick a hose down here, and suck the oil off the top of the water. Now, in order for, uh, to prevent the hose going down into the water layer, taking water with the removal of oil, we have a steel pin on the bottom of that pipe, and that re restricts the hose going down into the water layer. Uh, the float system is set up in this fitting here. Uh, basically, that is a stainless steel two-float system. Uh, they're weighted to float in water and sink in oil. So again, when the contractor installs this thing, they fill it up with clean water on startup. The floats would rise on the stem, and basically as the oil separates, it basically pushes the floats down or the floats sink in oil, and that'll sound alarm in the control panel. As we explained, we flow from the oil water separator by either a pump flow or a gravity flow. From here, we're going to discharge into a sanitary sewer system or a stormwater discharge, depending on the facility's permit and approval process. Highland Tank's cylindrical models for underground installations feature Highland's innovative high guard corrosion protection system. Our rectangular models are installed above ground and allow unconfined, unrestricted, OSHA compliant top access for safe visual inspection. Highland Tank offers several pre-engineered design options for oil water separators to meet various applications. Our G-Series includes an integral interceptor compartment to allow sand and other solids to settle out before entering the oil separation compartment. An affluent pump-out compartment can also be added to the separator to help provide the best solution for an application. Highland Tank's oil water separators featuring Corella range in size from 300 to 60,000 gallons and can handle flow rates up to 6,000 gallons per minute. Our team of professionals applies our complete line of wastewater treatment products to help provide solutions to even the most challenging projects. Contact Highland Tank to learn more about oil water separators featuring Corella.